is a fast-paced, full-contact sport on roller skates. Each team fields four blockers and one jammer, so that's five uh, people from each team on the track at once uh, for a total of ten. The jammers uh, have a star on their helmet. They're the ones who are trying to break through the pack. Um, once they go around and start racking up the points, they uh, gain those points by passing blockers. Mallory Brunet says many of Maine's roller derby teams dissolved during COVID. Now the sport is making a comeback. It is a very inclusive environment. Um, we take people of all genders, all gender expressions, um, all shapes, all sizes. The Bangor area derby team called the Bad Omens practice Monday and Thursday nights at the UMA Bangor Fitness Center gymnasium from 6 to 8 p.m. This week they've invited the public to those practices for an informal meet and greet where they're hoping to answer questions about the sport as well as attract new members, officials and volunteers. And it was nice to be able to try out gear, see how things fit. Um, and just meet everybody. Bad Omen members say no prior skating experience is required, but those interested will need their own equipment and have to pay membership dues, which include a $20 yearly fee to join and $40 a month for participation, all of which goes towards the cost of gym rentals. Members say it's a great way to exercise, have fun, and meet new friends with really cool roller derby names like Midnight Monstrosity and Tossum Blossom. Bangor speech therapist Sabrina Williams, who plans to join, already has the perfect roller derby name in mind. Maybe Sabs of Steel. I, you can thank my husband for that one. In Bangor, I'm Jody Hersey for ABC7 and Fox 22 News.